Hello, Scorpio! Yeah, 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 Scorpio, Scorp, Scorp, Scorp. What are y'all up to? What are you doing? All right, where you been? All right, did you watch your love read? Go watch your love read. All right, guys, these reads are all focused on money and career, all right? So this is for Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, because we're listening for the Shamani, baby. Now, if you're new to my channel, where have you been? We missed you. We'd like for you to join. All right, hit that subscribe and be a part of the family. Also, head on over to Instagram. Hang out with me on Tuesdays, 5.30, 6.30 Central Standard Time. All right, we're doing happy hour. That means half price reads, 11, 11 and 22, 22, baby. Come on through, have a drink, get your cards read and have fun. Let's be friends, let's be besties, all right? At Arena Luciano. All right, now, if you're a returning family member, you already know what's up. Big, big hugs, lots and lots of love, high fives, and some damn dirty shoulder rubs. What's going on, guys? There are some energies that I'm like, whoa, what is happening here? So, first off, right off the bat, something was just not for you financially or in, at work. You removed yourself from there. You got the fortune cookie. It says, nope. Mm-mm. Not for me. I'm leaving. <laughs> Now, what's going on? It's a multitasking. It was too much. They were requiring too much of you. Something about a loan, possibly. And watch your spending, okay? Do not, and pay attention to the receipts, guys, okay? Pay attention to the receipts. Something could get you in a little bit of a deeper hole than you need to be. The six could have been very important for you. Now, we have Unfinished Symphony going on right here. And this is a very cool card because this is kind of saying, like, all that documentation, all that paperwork, all the things that need to be finished, you better finish them, okay? You better finish it. You better go back and do what you got to do. Make sure everything is complete, okay? Loan denied, all right? So I want to say, like, if you applied for a loan and you got denied, you need to go and check the paperwork, all right? Check that paperwork. Also, there is something about you looking for a new job. Make sure that you're when you're filling out those applications and writing your resume that it makes sense, my friend, okay? And there are some new assets that you want, need, and desire, but you need to do the paperwork. Completely do all of the paperwork, okay? Your next message is that of, truth be told. So in this card, this is about like, look, if you are wanting to be um, an entrepreneur, what are you really doing to get there? Can you be real with yourself? Take the mask off. Let's open up our heart and let's be real, okay? Let's be real about what's going on. Because the truth needs to be told. I also feel like there's something that came out uh, for others. Like you found out something and you're like, yeah, this is just not for me. I'm good. Some of y'all will be working from home. Okay, working from home. There's some unexpected income coming in for you. All right. And you are definitely on the right, conne uh, right connection, right direction. There's like spilled gas outside and I went outside earlier. And it's just like it's really messing with my head. Anyways. There's a lot of changes coming in on your forefront financially. So awareness, practice being here now, okay? The meaning of being in the moment. You have to be right here aware of what's going on when you're filling out that paperwork this month, when you're writing things down, make sure you're putting in the right information or you're gonna get yourself into a lot of like holdbacks, all right? Your other messages from the butterflies, y'all know how I feel about the butterflies. Butterflies be giving me some mixed messages. I'm like, oh, I don't know how I'm gonna work this in. But it's the end of an era for you. Some of y'all will be leaving your work, like your nine to five, because you wanna pursue self-employment. You wanna be employed for yourself. You're gonna go into work for yourself. Now, I wanna say, like, if you're filling out a business loan, I need you to be very aware of how you're filling out. Also, I want you to pay attention, like, if you're doing your LSC or anything like that, like, um, Take your time filling out the paperwork. Get someone else to look over it and make sure everything is correct. All right? Now, let's get into your money. This is all about the money. All right. It's a victory. Someone's getting a car or something, baby. We got the chariot right on top. Yep, yep, yep. Major victory. Moving forward. What else we got here? We got an offer. We got an offer with the Ace of Cups. Someone's trying to give you a good offer. And then the tower. Ooh, okay, let's see. And then disappointment with the four of cups. And then you have a major decision with the two of swords. And you got to heal something with the star, okay? Or get your or get your tatas pierced. One of the two. I don't know. 
If you get in a Pierce, call me. I'll, I'll drive. No, I'm just <laughs> it hurts. Just like, <laughs> it hurts. All right, Scorpio. Get, come back, Scorpio. We're talking about money, not tatas, okay? Anyways. So I do feel like you had a major victory. There's also talks about maybe getting a car loan and then something falls through. You're very disappointed and you're going to have to figure out something with the finances, okay? Overall energy, we have the star. Now, I really just want to go focus in on this tower, but we're going to take we're going to do a little take it easy, okay? Cuz you know, I begin all worked up and stuff. I don't know. I want to know. I want to know. I know. So I'm going to take it easy. The 16th could be very important for you, okay? The 16th. Oh, that goes over here. Okay. What's, oh, come on, one more, just come on. And we'll cut the deck. So the development of news and enthusiasm with the page of wands, and then we are acting first and thinking later. All right, Scorpio, there's a lot about action being taken with this chariot, so I wanna say like really read through the fine print. You know, I you know I say that all the time, but I'll be signing stuff, I'm gonna be reading it. And then I'm like, oh, I'm I'm supposed to be doing that too. My bad. <laughs> They're like, did you read what you signed? I'm, mm -mm, I sure didn't. I just wanted what I wanted. No, now I'm in a now I'm in a situation. <laughs> so don't be like me. All right. All right. So we got this eight coming in right here. Eight is about abundance. We have a tower situation with the chariot. For some, you could be experiencing some unexpected car issues coming in. Unexpected travel could be coming in, okay? The Page of Pentacles. Pay attention to what you're signing, okay? And then the Page of Cups. Some of y'all just got some really intense information. It's a very heavy situation. I see car repairs and I see travel delays, okay, Scorpio? So we're going we're gonna to look at this and we're going to see what is this... Um, information that's coming through okay because two pages is news there's some news coming in okay there's something brewing what is it scorp what is it the healer of the ages and the temple path let's get one more one more and deceit okay oh somebody could be going to court okay so there's a situation of somebody lying to you oh yeah we fixed that on your car oh yeah we did those home repairs oh yeah we did that and they did it and you're driving t t t t and poof, the car messes up, okay? That could have already happened. But we got the Ace of Cups. We got Captain Save Me come through. And then we got the Lotus Flower there. So this is a big blessing that's coming through. But there is some deceit. And I want to say, look, be careful because somebody is a damn dirty liar, okay? Two of Cups reversed. You, you took your cup back. You said, I'm mine. It's mine. The Ace of Wands, you, you putting some stuff to action and you're taking your time now, okay? Now you're like slow and steady. And you're like, oh, really? You really thought you were going to get over on me? Well, let me show you what Scorpio can do, okay? And that's why this tower happens. Bam! Financials. Boof! Okay? I do think an unexpected car expense could happen, okay? Do not overpromise either. See. the magician something comes through you're upset and uh, you're not going to work with them you're not going to do this you're not you're very burdened by it you're not going to do this it's not working out for you i do see some manipulation going on you're very upset and you're like no i can't do this i'm not going to do it and that's what's leaving you at the four of cups um this is like unexpected and i guess that's why the awareness card is coming in you're just like what i didn't even see this coming I hate that feeling seven of pentacles reverse it feels like nothing you do is really helping the situation so you're gonna go to the higher power okay either you're going to hr or you're going to the the big guy upstairs or your higher power okay because you need help with this decision with the two of wands I see a lot of prayer and then i see like movement travel the ending of something okay like we got to go we got to figure out what's going on for some of y'all who are in a situation where you're going to have to do an immediate travel there is something about your finances. You may not have enough. You're going to have to take out a loan. There's also something about a court cost, and there's something about the car, okay? So this month, I'm going to say watch your spending, Scorpio, because you don't want to get caught off guard. You've got to pay attention to the finances this month, and you've got to pay attention to what's going and coming out of your pocket, okay? Um, let's see. Four of Cups. What's up with this Four of Cups? Time. I'm afraid it's too late to take action. Some of y'all are on a time crunch with this. 
you feel very unappreciated you feel like no one's helping you and it's a very unexpected thing you're just like holy moly I can't even I didn't even expect this to happen okay oh. All right, let's look at the two of swords, major decision. What is this decision about? What are we making a decision about financially? We're getting out of our head. We're getting out of the eight of swords. We're going to get more information with this page, okay? And we're going to be really strong about it, okay? Whatever comes out, we're going to be okay. And there's another page right there. So for some of y'all, and I hate to be like Debbie Downer because this is not for everybody, okay? So if it fits, it fits, and if it doesn't, it doesn't, all right? I'm just gonna tell you the message that I'm getting. I have two pages up here in the front, and I have two pages at the end. When I get four pages in a read, that means usually, okay, there's something going on that you're gonna get news about somebody's health, okay? And with it being a sudden trip, this person could live at a distance from you. Now, as you get that information, you could have car issues. It's just like you feel like everything is working against you. So the way that we're gonna combat at this or the way that we're going to move forward is whatever happens we are going to save our money this month we're not going to go out to brunch with our friends we're not going to do all that foolishness we're going to save our money and we're going to be very aware we're going to read through the fine print and we're going to make sure we're making good choices okay because this is like out of nowhere all right out of nowhere this happens but with the star at the end it's going to be okay there's the world. So the 29th could be important also. There's something about you having to travel, having to travel, okay? You're very broken hearted about it. And there are financial issues about this travel, okay? And I'm gonna say, watch out with people who are very jealous of you because there is a such thing as evil eye or mal de ojo. What the hell, so got bit by a mosquito, damn. Now, Pay attention to those things as you're going forward with your finances, okay? The, that message was not to scare you. That message is to prepare you. If it fits, it fits. And if it don't, turn it off and go at your love read. <laughs> okay, let's get some Lenormand on our money. What's going on? What's going on with our money? We got something new coming in. That's very confusing. Causes us anxiety about our stability, okay? And there's a lot of talk going on. Everybody's talking. Everyone wants to be there. And it could be about somebody's health, okay? So keep that in mind. And let's go on into our career read. What's going on in our career? Let's see. Work, 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 Sonora. Shake your body line. I think that's her name. I don't know. I don't remember. All right. We, at least we got some money coming in. We got the Ten of Pentacles. We got that wealth, okay? This is um, Venus and Virgo, okay? So financially, things are things are blossoming. Things are looking good. We got flowers going on here. Princess of Wands, we got to put something in action. All right, Scorpio. And then we have um, Sun and Scorpio with the Eight of Pentacles. I mean, Sun and Virgo, okay? Sun and Virgo, my bad, Virgo. So there's something about work, something new initiating at work, okay? And then the King of Cups, they like, woo, this is good. <laughs> and he's got his little trusted steed by him, okay? And they're having a good time because they're abundant with the Empress, okay? So work is looking really, really good for you. And then, but we're still worried probably financially about stuff going on at home because I see the home with the beehive. Now, this is Taurus in Venus, okay? So we're very worried about the home front and we're very worried about what our finances are doing. So it could affect your work life, but you're going to keep it going, okay? Things are going to be all, things are going to be okay. Because you know what? They have nothing else better to be than okay. <sighs> Scorpio, what's going on? A lot of Virgo energy coming in for you, Scorpio. So pay attention to where Virgo falls in your chart. Pay attention to any Virgos in your life that could be wanting to assist. Okay. Let's cut her up. What do we got here? It's a no. Someone's going to make you an offer and it's a no for you. Okay. I know the sun's like, yes, but it is the reverse. It's a no. Something about the six. There's something about the six that happened. And it's a no. Sorry. All right, let's see. Ten of Pentacles. There's a trip, okay? We got a trip coming in. We have vacation in time coming in. That causes a tower moment, okay? So that's confirmation again. Got the tower again. Jeez. 
Princess of Wands says, let's take our time. Okay, let's take our time with the Knight, the Prince of Pentacles. This could be a family situation. And it's something that would make us very happy, but we got to take our time with it. And it's could flourish in August, okay? There's something about August. Let's look at this tower. What is up with the tower? Why is the tower following Scorpio? Money tree. People think that you're just going to give them all this money. They want you to take them shopping. Do not overspend. Look, unexpected expenses, and it's, there's a medical sign. So that is my confirmation. Someone, not everybody, not everybody, okay? Scorpio, don't be messaging me, talking about you talking smack, da 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 because I like you, okay? I like you, Scorpio. Don't be mean to me. But there are some that are going to experience that, and it's a very tough decision. And I feel like the, you want to do something really quick, and it has to do with like a family situation. There's also something about two tens in your read. So if there's a position or an opening at work that comes up, I would apply for it because it's something that will make you very, very happy and very fulfilled, and you will love it, especially if you're seeing the number of four, four, four. Okay. All right. Let's look at your eight of pentacles. Why you at work? Looking all sexy and stuff. Look at you all sexy. Sexy Scorpio. It's like giving it to him quick. There's that 888. I'm telling you, there's something about August. Now, a lot of quick communication coming in about work, okay? This could be job offers, job leads, job information. And then we have the Queen of Swords reversed. And we're trying to get over that, okay? And I feel like that's something you did not see coming. This Queen of Swords reverse is being very foul with the way that they're communicating. And you're like, whoa, you need to take it a little easy over there, okay? Like, we can't be doing all this. You need to, you need to stop, okay? Queen of Swords, what's up? What's up, Queen of Swords? Put the phone down. Too much screen time is making you awkward. Go talk to a live person. I feel like this person is watching you do stuff. And running and telling everybody. And then you, you're you just like, look. like I feel like you're just like, what's next, Queen of Swords? Like, what are you going to do next? Scorpio, I'm going to tell people, don't mess with no Scorpio. Whoa, Scorpio, like in the middle of your read, like my camera just said, I need a new camera probably. It was like, hey girl, like you just lost all your, <laughs> all your information, all your videos, you just, you have to reinsert the SD card and blah, blah, blah. So when I said making the right decision and then you're feeling financially constrained about it and it's falling right under self-employment and the end of an era, I kind of feel like there's some really tough decisions that you're going to have to make financially, okay? And it could deal with a family situation, all right? So just keep that in mind. I don't know. That just, like, really threw me off. I apologize. <sighs> I need a new camera. I need to, probably need a new SD card, too. I need to invest in that. So let's look at the Empress, okay? And the Empress wants you to know there's a false start coming in. I want to say miscommunication about a new beginning, that you really wanted to have okay and then the queen of pentacles is reversed so i'm going to need some clarity there so i feel like you are shooting down an offer or shooting down something because you prefer to go work for yourself or do something that fits your personality better okay the magician in the mirror anxiety there's that 98 and then you're thinking give me overall overall of your money okay <sighs> Look, I really feel like at work, somebody's watching you at work and maybe you're doing like your business at work or you know, like you're, maybe you're making a sale for your business while you're on your lunch break and someone's watching you. There's th the two queens reverse is I'm going to say there's like weird vibes at work. Okay. There's weird vibes at work. And I almost like with me losing that video, like I was really nervous that I lost all that work. I'm going to say, make sure you double check your work this month. Make sure that you're very aware of who's around you, what's going on. Don't multitask too much. Stay focused. Okay. There's going to be an opportunity that comes your way. It could bring you a lot of money and don't get so worked up about it, but go for it. Okay. Go for it. That really threw me off and I apologize, Scorpio, because I was like all in your read and then all of a sudden that happened and then I panicked and I was like, what's going on? So let's get some Lenormand for you. Let's get some clarity for the um, career read. Let's get some ideas. Let's get some ideas for this career read. What's going on for Scorpio? 
Let's see, what are some clues? What are some things I need to know? We have an ending with the grave. I want to say there's some secrets or some information coming out or something is being spread, okay? There's the your energy. It's a burden for you. That keeps coming off that something is a burden. And I kind of say like it's because of a friend or, you know, there's this friend that's bringing you more information. Maybe they heard something you didn't. Let me get some clarity on the, why is it a burden? It's heavy on your heart. Um, it's a new opportunity, and you feel like your friend might block it. So, this is what I'm I'm thinking with this situation is, if you have an opportunity to move up in the company, you have an opportunity to get a new job, go to a different section, do something different, don't tell anybody, just do it, okay? Because, you know, our work besties, even though there are work besties, you know, they don't want to see you go. Yeah, you're leaving. So you're cutting ties, you're moving on, you receive what you need, and you're, you're going to get there. You're like, I'm going to go. I'm gone. And stay away from the gossip at work, okay? Stay away from that. And it says coffee cup. And I'm going to say be very careful in the coffee room or the water cooler, like they say. Meeting and talking and building friendships is important, but we're not going to gossip. And so I do think that you have a friend who likes to gossip at work and likes to say things. And I would not share your information with everyone, okay, Scorpio? Because they have a tendency to go back and tell people things. Like, I don't tell everybody that I run a business from home. I don't tell them everything that I do because a lot of people wouldn't agree with what I do. However, I do have some people I do trust and you, you have to realize who you can trust and who you can't and you're very good at that. You're, Scorpio, you're naturally a, an intuitive, okay? Guidance on how to work in this situation. We have that of marigold, sacred rituals. I'm going to say get yourself a little pattern of like a to-do list or something so you stay focused. Summertime is going to be very good for you. Let everyone see how well you are and then we got new moon, okay? Birth what your heart desires. What do you really want, Scorpio? Do you want to stay or do you want to go? And celebrate your transformations. So I do see an elevation. I do see you moving up to the next level. And I do see people saying, you know what? We'd rather have Scorpio run the business than we have you. All right? Or I feel like Scorpio says, I'm ready to go run my own business. There's, some, there's something about being very aware. Pay attention to the details this month, okay? You have to pay attention. Pay attention to what's coming in and going out in your money and also what's going on at work. And do not engage in any gossip because somebody is perpetrating, okay? All right, guys. Now, remember, come hang out with me. Let's be besties, okay? Come on over to Instagram. Let's hang out. And also, let me know if you want me to do a pick-a-card reading sometime this month. I got a lot of time off, all right? Take care.